So let's look at how we can use a personal Kanban using an application. Now there are several applications out there. I wouldn't be surprised if there were a dozen or two. But the one of the most popular ones is uh, this app here called Trello. And Trello is free to use initially. If you want to upgrade to Team Editions, then there is a another charge, but it's basically an online Trello board. I love it and I use it personally. This is my week so far. Uh, notice there's a, a to-do column here, a today column, a waiting for column and a done this week. I've also added another column. Kanban is really flexible. People invent their own column names and, and titles. This is when I do a retrospective week on week there are things that I need to check. So this is a little reminder of what I've learned in the past. And I'm sort of building these reminders, these ticklers, these uh, workflows into my daily routines. Now notice this isn't a particularly small today column, but most of these are quite short. And these are all very real. So the first two items in my today are actually appointments. Trello allows you to put in a date and a time and you can see that these are red because actually the time's already passed. Now I've had my HIV Zoom meeting and I'm going to click and drag this over to done this week as I have for the chiropodist and I have already produced and published these videos. I'm currently working on this one. No, nope, I've done that one. I'm currently working on this one here, which is this video I'm recording right now. So you can see very quickly, I'm building up my done this week column. Now, what happened during the HIV Zoom meeting is that towards the end, the host, Nick Laffin, asked if we could meet. And we've had an email correspondence since. I'm waiting for Nick to get back to me so that we can meet up at the train station when he gives me his train schedule. So I'm waiting for Nick there. It's a good example. Um, in the comments here, to confirm train arrival time and it's got a, an audit list of all the things that I have done. I've moved it around a bit for the purposes of this exercise. So this is what's remaining in terms of my uh, work for today. And that's basically the Kanban board. I mean, there are other features. Let me just show you a couple. You may notice that some of these have orange labels, yellow labels, blue labels. These are labels down here, all to do with different aspects. Some people like to label their cards in terms of priority, priority number one, number two, number three. But I simply let the order in the column dictate the priority. So tomorrow, if I can clear off this work today, tomorrow, I want to prepare a video on destiny, personal destiny for Tuesday Zoom meeting tomorrow evening. Another feature is if we go into that card, you'll see that you can actually add checklists. And as I go through, I've got a little workflow here. I can copy this from other cards so I can have replicated workflows. So for a video, I can tick off things and it shows there a 20% complete. And if I close it, it'll show one out of five steps have been completed. I'll uncheck that because I haven't actually started it yet. But this is my workflow for designing a video, if you're interested. I script it out in full first, then design the visuals. I record and narrate it, as I'm doing now with this video. I edit it and then publish it, usually to YouTube. So that's it, really. Trello. Try it out. Trello.com. Create your own account. And if I go to my boards here, you'll see that some of them I can share with others. This one, for example, I share with my son, Robert, who's got a, an IT business called Daegu. He's sharing my board with him so that I can comment and advise him. Also got a board here for my website collection and uh, my projects. This is my next steps board. I'll star that. So it's one of my favorite boards. That's it. Personal Kanban. I love the way, though, you got this workload here that you can easily prioritize. And then as you complete things, you just drag them over.
I love that, this idea of pulling work through rather than being driven by it. 